Hi, we're down at the Round House in Camden still um, at the iTunes Festival where we'll be broadcasting the best of the festival for the entire month of July on myspace.com forward slash iTunes Festival. And I'm here with the gorgeous and talented Kate Nash. Thanks. Thank Hi. you so much for joining us. <laughs> Thank you for having me. So tonight um, you're playing on a, a, at the iTunes Festival. It's a, it's a free gig. How does this normally like compare to an ordinary gig that you do? Is it different? Is it nice to give something back to the fans? Yeah, it is. It's really nice. It's really nice to be part of that. I think it's cool for the fans to um, get something for free. Are there any like rituals that you do before you go on stage to like calm your nerves or? Um, well, no, I don't really have any rituals. Just kind of have a drink and like listen to music mm -hmm. and um, I like to make sure I'm with the band and stuff. So on stage, is there any embarrassing things or what's the most embarrassing thing that's ever happened to you while you performed? I think because I'm so clumsy, I'm used to being embarrassed, like <laughs> falling over and all the usual things that people mind about. I don't really, because I've done it so many times. <laughs> Collaborations, have you got any on the horizon? Well, I'm about to release my single on the on the 12th of July, um, Kiss That Girl, and we, I did a cover of Great Big Kiss by the Shangri-Las with Billy Bragg, so that's about to be released. I'd like to work with Billy again, because he's a really interesting, smart, clever person. So who would your role models be? Um, Kathleen Hanna from Bikini Kill was always a, a big role model for me because just because she's uh, of what she did and and stood for in the 90s, you know, the right girl bands and um, and her music as well. And obviously this is going out on MySpace and there's going to be lots of like artists and bands uh, watching. And yeah. Do you have any advice as like, you know, things to do, things not to do, or tips? <laughs> um, yeah, well, I think that it's just important to concentrate on songwriting and writing and, and letting yourself develop playing loads of gigs, doing things independently, making sure you really trust the people that you decide to eventually work with if you do, for example, like a manager or a label. Just be really um, be really careful with signing anything. Mm -hmm. You know, just if you don't have to rush into those things because if somebody really wants to sign you, then they'll wait mm -hmm. until you've had advice from like a lawyer. <laughs> so like real tips. <laughs> <laughs> What's the strangest thing that like a fan has ever given you or, or have you got any strange or fans that stand out? I have a bit, I have one fan that is a little bit frightening. I remember trying I was trying to sneak into this really quiet um my friend was putting on this night and it was like a really quiet kind of acoustic night. I was trying to creep in and he was there and he like screamed my name and said I was there. <laughs> and like I'm literally Subtle. trying to creep into my seat and I was like Oh my god! It was the most embarrassing. I think it's the most embarrassing moment of my entire life. I just kind of <laughs> sat down, really bright red, and then he came over to me and was like, "Trying to, Ugh, can I kiss you?" And I was like, "Oh, oh my god!" <laughs> and the band are still playing. Like, what are you doing? <laughs> um, so that's pretty embarrassing. But people can be really lovely as well. Mm. There can be fans who make you. Like, I had a girl in Germany recently made me. She made me this thing that it's like a wooden frame, like a round circle wooden frame, and it's so. I don't know what exactly what kind of sewing that is, but she sewed like a picture of me and my bunny rabbit. Oh, was it good? It was so nice. Yeah, it's in my it's in my living room now. Well, thank you so much for chatting to us. Oh, cool. We really no appreciate it. And if um, you want to see Kate Nash's performance from tonight, it will be on myspace.com forward slash iTunes Festival for the next seven days. And if you want to check out Kate Nash's MySpace profile, do you remember your URL? It's myspace.com forward slash Kate Nash Music.